text so that it looks a little more interesting. But before we do that, let's take a look at what this looks like and you'll see the difference. So in order to do that, we save this as a draft first. And my computers are running a little bit slow here. You save it as a draft and then the button next to where it says save draft over to the right here says preview. You can click on preview the post here and you can also click on preview post here at the top and see what it looks like. So let's give a look see and this will take us to the blog as it actually appears. So here we have our content here and it's just plain black and white text. But it looks good. Now to get back to the post, you go up here where it says edit post and click on that and it will take you back to where you can edit the post. And we're going to do some simple editing here. Uh, you can, uh, for example, make things bold or italics. We'll highlight this, highlight what it is you want to change. Click on bold. If you want to change it to italics or add italics, you can do that as well. You can also add color to your text. And so what we want to do is uh, make all of these, the, the headings and or subtitles uh, in color. So we go here to where it says text color and we click on this down button here and you'll see the color palette drop down. We're going to make this purple. And you'll see that purple comes up under here. So when we go to the next item to color, we just simply click on that and it will change it to that particular color. If you want to add another color or a different color, you go back here to the arrow button and you would add, let's say, for example, green. But we want to keep it all consistent throughout, so we'll keep the purple. You can also add bullets. So we'll take bullets or numbers or numbered lists. So let's take, for example, uh, this right here. And you simply put your cursor by where you want to make something into bullets, or you can just create the bullets as you're doing your content and you click hit the enter or return button we're going to make all of these set up for bullets here and then we're going to make this paragraph here we're going to take out these this punctuation these punctuations and then what you will do is you will highlight the items that you want to make into bullets go here to bullet list and it will make it into bullets or if you want to make it into a numbered list you click on number list and you have it there you can also decorate the bullets you can make it bold you can put it make it into italics you can also color it so let's for example color this orange and you will see what this looks like now let's go Let's save this as a draft, and then we're, we will preview it again to see the changes, to see what it looks like on the post itself, to see if it meets with our expectations. So we simply go here to preview post, and we see that the decoration has taken place it makes it a little more interesting. In the next video we're going to go over how to add pictures to your post to make it become even become more alive. See you in the next video.